Hi everyone, today I'm going to teach you how to make a peace crane. A peace crane. Now tradition is if you make a thousand of these peace cranes a year it will give you good luck. So here we're just going to get started. Here's a, um, our green piece of uh, square. Okay, so you're going to start with a square piece of paper and the first thing you do we're going to just flip it over and you're going to fold it in half. Good. Then you're going to just take it and fold it over to the side and make a little square. Then you're going to open your square back up. Now the next step is you're just going to take, we're going to start with the right side. We're going to bend the right side, bring it to the center line, and fold it. Now the open side is here at the top. Then from here we're going to just flip it over. And we're going to do the same thing on the other side. We're going to fold the left corner down this time and right to the center line. Now when you do it right, the um, opening is going to be on the bottom here. Now what we're going to do is we're just going to take this, we're going to open it up, okay, like this, and then you're just going to fold it over. Now once you open it up and fold it over, you should have kind of like a little um, legs inside. Now the next step is you're just going to take this and we're going to fold the right side over to the center line, fold the left side over to the center line, just like that. Now let's flip it over and we're going to do the same thing on the other side. Okay, So we're going to fold this, get it to the center line left to the center line. That's great. Okay, so this is what you got at this point. Now what we're going to do is we're going to take this top corner and fold it right to the top here, right, right along the top edge. And we need to make this crease because when we do the next fold, we're going to use this uh, um, as a marker crease. So you're just going to fold it over and then you're going to open it back up. Okay, now let's go into the next part. You're going to just take this, these folds that you just made and open it up. Now you're going to take this top and bring it up to right where that fold was. Now the, the corners that you just folded are you're going to have to reverse the fold along those lines on both sides. And we're going to do that on the other side. Good, now it should look like this. We're going to flip it over, do the same thing on the other side. So you're going to open it up, take the bottom, bring it all the way up to the top. I think this is one of the most difficult um, folds. And now you have the same thing on both sides. So it looks like this. You can fold it, make sure you line up the edges. Good. Now the next step is we're going to take the bottom. And now when you see the bottom, it's split. The top is not. What you're going to do is you're just going to take the um, right side first and fold it over like this. Good. Then you're going to do the same thing on the left side. Now once you do that, you're going to just flip the whole thing over and repeat the process on the other side. So you're going to take the right, fold it over, then you're going to take the left, fold it over, and at this point this is what it looks like. You have this kind of uh, triangle at the top with a real long end and you have two kind of like legs at the bottom. Now what I'm going to do is I'm going to just take the left side, only half of it, and flip it over, okay, like this, and bring it over to the, the right side. Then we're going to flip it over, do the same thing again, okay, so you're going to take the left and bring it over to the right. Very good. Now we're going to make um, what's going to end up being the head of, of our crane. You're going to take the bottom, bring it all the way up the top. 
Good. Now I'm going to take it and I'm just going to fold the top corner down slightly. Good. Now looks like this. Okay, you got a little bit of a fold there. And we're going to flip it over. Now on the other side, we're going to make what's going to end up being the tail. So you're going to just flip this up over the top and right like this. Good. Now from here, all you're going to do is you're going to fold this back over. So what you're going to do is you're going to just take the um, folds that you have and you're going to just fold the left over the right again. And then on the other side, we're going to fold the left over the right. So it looks like this at this point. Okay, now we're just going to take it and we're going to pull the tail out. We flip it over and we're going to pull what's going to be the tail out. Good. Just put it to an attractive angle. I'm going to straighten it up a little bit. Then we're going to take the other side. We're going to pull the other side and this is going to be the head. Okay, so you're going to bend it like this and then pull the head out. Just like that. Good. Then I like to give it a little bit of a twist at the end here. Kind of make the beak. Okay, now once you made the beak, got the rest, now all you have to do is fold down the wings. I like to fold them down. And then if you take your finger and run it like this, it will kind of make a nice uh, curve in the end of the wing. Flip it over to the other side. Bend it down. Good. And then I do the same thing. I just take my finger like this underneath, roll it up like that, make a nice curve. And you can always push down a little bit on the top. And there you go, you got your crane.